Good morning, my friends. Yes, if you're watching from abroad, this is the great British weather. Well, anyway, in today's vlog, it's just a quick one for you because uh, if you've been watching the channel, you know that I've currently moved over to an all electric Porsche Taycan uh, electric car. Uh, and having a few issues with charging. Like last night, uh, I'd been to Leicester, came back, I'd got about, I'd say about 40 miles left. I thought I'd go and charge up, went down to the local charger and a Tesla's parked in it. Bloody Tesla's. Um, and uh, he was charging up, so I had to wait. And I thought I can't wait anymore. Uh, so funnily enough, one of my viewers from Blue Flame Energy Solutions uh, actually contacted me and said, I fit electric chargers, uh, Mike Master, and I watch your channel. Now, he doesn't want to be on the vlog, but today uh, he's coming up here and he's going to fit me an Anderson electric charger right here uh, outside my office in Mansfield uh, at the house where my office is. Uh, and I'm going to charge it up in the daytime while I'm working. Uh, he's going to fit it. I'm going to show you uh, basically what the charger is like and, and go through a few things just very quickly uh, just to show you what it's all about, basically. But hopefully that uh, will... Uh, Put an end to me running around and looking for chargers. Uh, if you can hear an engine running that's because uh, Angie's over there and she's gonna have to go and take me for a costa because it's morning and I need something to cheer me up because this is all we've got. I mean I always think though right there's blue sky above these clouds and there will be when I take off to go to America uh, and in early November so make sure you hit that subscribe button because lots of vlogs coming your way. Firstly first stop New York City so keep an eye out for that one. Anyway without further ado my friends let's go. Come on Ange. Hang on a minute. She's changed her car. What's all this about? You've changed your car. Morning, Turn that Lily. music down. Oh. You've changed your car. I have, yeah. You've got a soft top. I have. And what, look at the weather. For, What's what happened? For? Come on, take me to Costa. I'll take you to Costa. Come on then, get in. Right, here we are, Costa Coffee. I'm gonna grab a quick um, to-go cup and then back so we can get this charger fitted. Funnily enough, the charger that I use, the public one, is over there and it's empty this morning. <laughs> I ran out of charge again. Oh no. Do you know ever since I'm I've got so this electric car, every time everyone's like, oh, can you pick me up? I've got no charge. And then can we go the other day? Got, you, just get. I'm going to start charging you for fuel. I know. I tell you what, it's really cheap having an electric car yeah, because they always run out of battery and end up everybody yeah, else taking you places. Come Here's on. <laughs> I'm sorry, but this is Actually, no good. I have got cup holders. Where? Are they not cup holders? What are they then? She's got no cup holders. Are they right back there? That's the. Do you know what? People who have cup holders <laughs> and they just fill them full of garbage. Well, it's my glasses. I need to see where I'm There's going. There's paper and all sorts in there. Now look, receipts, you need to stop paper. it because you want picking up because you've got no battery in your car. You know what, people? Let's put the record straight, by the way. People are going, is that your missus? No. No, it's, it's not. She's my friend. This is my barmy friend. And then we've got, is that your sister? She's real fun. No, she's not my sister. <laughs> just part of the family. <laughs> just part of the McMaster family. Anyway, we're going. To, you've come here to see about this charger, so let's go and see uh, Mark now. He should be here, yeah. and then we'll go and see about this charger and get it fitted, so I can use my own car. Use your own car? Yeah. I can't wait. Keep <laughs> using on. mine. Onwards. All oh, right, well, we've picked the right weather for it anyway. So uh, we've got Mark and Tom, actually. Uh, they don't want to be on camera, which is fine, but I'm going to show you basically what they're doing. So we're having um, basically an Anderson charger fitted. Uh, it's terrible weather. Um, it is supposed to be one of the best chargers. Uh, now, I said at the beginning it was Blue Flame. It's the subsidiary company of theirs, the sister company, which is Blue Spark, obviously, because that's electric. So really looking forward to this. Oh, there's the charger. I can't wait for this. It means no longer running around waiting for Teslas to get out my way. Oh, don't you just 
love the great British weather. So, well, my brolly's blown away and <laughs> doing a Boris Johnson there. So basically, uh, if you have one of these chargers fitted, up until I think it is April next year, you get £350 grant off of the government. Now, the great thing about this is you don't have to go in and claim all this because these guys will actually do it for you. Uh, you just supply them some details and it's all done for you. So it's dead straightforward. You haven't got to mess around. So that is uh, really important. So hurry up and get it done before April and then you can get the money off the government because they're trying to push people to have these home charges and go green. God blimey, I think it's time to go in and have a coffee. I might just leave them to it. Oh. The sun's out now as well. Got blue sky, there we go, a few clouds passing by. That'd be great on a time lapse actually. They're going really fast. In fact, it looks like a time lapse. Anyway, we're moving swiftly on. So electric's off now. Uh, we've got it fixed to the wall. Super excited about this. If you are going to do an electric vehicle, then you, I can tell you firsthand, you do need uh, an electric charger at home. And these guys have been absolutely brilliant. And as I say, uh, they view the channel. One of them is a great viewer of the channel and he also loves Tenerife. How many times have you been to Tenerife? Eight times he's been to Tenerife, so support these guys. I'll put all their contact details in the description down below. Uh, I'll show you a little bit of how it's going on. Again, as I say, I'm not gonna get the faces on. Not everybody likes to be on the camera like me, you know, in front of it, showing off. Anyway, have a look at the, uh, have a look at the uh, work that's gone on here. Great workmanship, looking good. the cover for the front of the unit takes about just been having a bit of a chat takes about six to eight hours roughly uh, to charge your car at home obviously it's not as fast as the public charges but it is cheaper and I've been reading up online as well uh, a lot cheaper than obviously paying down at the public charges and the best thing about it is uh, I'm with British Gas here uh, with their electric and they have a special tariff so if you charge it overnight it's actually cheaper so I, you can get it under like a, I think about around about a tenner to maybe 10 to 18 pounds for about a 270 mile journey which is really really cheap compared to the price of petrol and diesel these days so spot on you just leave it in there you also get an app with this anderson as well so you can time it to come on and time it to go off and you can lock it in the car as well and you can also turn it off on the app so that nobody can come up and drive up to your drive and just decide to just charge their car up on your electricity so they've thought of everything Next step, boxes fitted to the wall. Now I've got to get my phone, download the Anderson app, which is Connects, I think it's called, Anderson Connects. Gonna download that. There's a QR code in the top, and we then link that box to this app so that I can control that box and switch it on and off so people can't just drive up uh, and take your electric off you. Right, let's go and try this out. Right, okay, so the moment of truth now, because it's now live, I'm gonna set up the app in a minute, I've just downloaded it. Um, this has been really, really straightforward. I have to say, when I first got an electric car, I was a little bit sort of like apprehensive about, oh, how do you get an electric charger fitted at home? What do you do? What about all the paperwork? There's lots of paperwork to do. These guys do all the paperwork for you. It's literally been really, really straightforward. Uh, so, so, so good. We're gonna, we're gonna plug it in now. Angie's here as well. I know, I can't wait for this because I don't have to be your taxi no more. Exactly, because I can just charge yep, it now while, while, I'm, while I'm outside the office. So we're going to charge it up now. So uh, here we go. How oh, do you open the door? Do you just... Uh, do, uh, do you open the front? Oh, you don't no, open the front? No, you... Ah, oh, okay. Just to keep it all nice and neat and out of the way for you. Right, here we go. Look at that. Okay, so go on, Ench, press the door. Let's try it. Wow. Let's okay. see if you can plug it in today. So we plug it in. Like that. There we go. Oh, we got a light. We have a light. 
Oh, I can hear the car doing something. Charging, then. I think it's charging, it's coming up there. Here we go, let's undo the door. Yes, we have charged, just look at this. We're in business. So all I've got to do now is download the app and away we go. And that's brilliant, nice little charger there. I thought there was a door on the front, there isn't. It wraps around nice and neatly. Uh, it's, that can then connects to your Wi-Fi in the house as well, to your router, uh, which I'm going to switch on in a minute because I've had the power off and then you can do everything on the app. I'll show you a little bit of that in a minute as well. Dead excited, look at that. It just pull up now and I charge up. How straightforward was that? collecting me now instead of me having to come to fetch you. Exactly. I'm going to put all the details to these guys in the description down below. So if you have got an electric car uh, or you're getting an electric car, then give them a call. These guys are absolutely spot on. Also, make sure that you do it in plenty of time. Don't leave it till the last minute until you've got a car like me. Do it prior so that you've got one when your car arrives. What's the wait time for one of these? Three weeks. About three weeks. So if you're gonna get an electric car, get in touch with them, contact details down below and do it three weeks or four weeks before you get your car and then you can plug it in when you get a town. So there we go. I'll see you guys in a minute. All oh, right, so I've set the app up. Basically it's all on here uh, and it now says uh, charging 7.3 kilowatts. Uh, it also tells you how much your current charges as well. It's cost me 0.02 pence at the moment. Um, dead easy to set up. There's a little button underneath. You press three times, link it to your phone, and you can actually disable it as well. You get all the reports. Everything is on this app. I'll put the link uh, below for the app as well. Uh, but these guys are absolutely spot on. Really, really pleased. Very straightforward. And I think that the biggest thing uh, for me was how to get that uh, grant back from the government having to fill in all the paperwork well they take all that away they do it all for you I just sent them a few documents and uh, and they did it they did, they did the rest for me it was so so straightforward really really pleased now now I haven't got to worry I can come up plug it in it locks it in you control everything from the app absolutely superb anyway that's all from me today Join me in the next one and don't forget if you are new to the channel to like, subscribe and click the little bell for notifications of when I upload new videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Coffee time for me. See you later.